Really not sure how this deal's supposed to work. I, uh, I got a new, I'm trying a new audio for, uh, for the Garmin, for the Verb. I got a, uh, oh, a lapel mic and it's powered, it's got, it has its own power source. And then, uh, I got an adapter that plugs into the back of the Verb and, and trying to figure out a way I can get better at audio. After that last video I made with the pack trip, me and Juan had some really good conversations, some dialogue that probably would have been real interesting to hear, but uh, nobody, you know, you could, it, the, the mics on the, on the, on the verb, you just pick up me and it was terrible sound and uh, never, you couldn't hardly pick up Juan at all. So. I'll try this. If this works, I can always get a uh, synth synthesizer. I can't say it. Uh, remote deal that that I could use these mics and just broadcast it either to a separate recording device or to the Verb or whatever I'm using at the time. I got a Canon DSLR also. And, but anyway, we're up here. Okay, this big old canyon back here behind my place. There's some deer in here and some javelina and pretty tough trailing conditions. It's desert and, and the sand, and, but the, it's a good place to exercise the dogs. And, and there, you know, there's lines come through here from time to time. If uh, I had to leave Sheila, Sheila, Jazz, and, and P, uh, Sheila came in season and the other ones are starting to come in season. So I left all them. So I got the spade females and, and, and the male dogs here but I got an idea what I'd like to try to do I don't know if I have any support doing it or not there's really no money to be made doing this I just it, it's about the only way I can do anything creative really and I enjoy sharing what we do but anyway if I can get 400 subscribers I'll do a seven or eight day lion hunt on the mules and uh document every day and and uh, you know where we go how many miles we go any details you know in the morning uh, uh, just to say where we're going and what's going on which dogs I'm taking you know anything that we've had you know and then in the afternoon uh, anything interesting happened throughout the day uh, doc you know record that document that the dogs trailing you know record that and if we catch a lion then record that but also try to illustrate or depict all the hardships that go in you know I I read a lot of the I read a deal on one of those forums I think it was a 24-hour campfire or something like that where this guy he, he they were talking about calling in lions. It was in the predator forum of that, or predator part of that forum. They were talking about calling in lions. And some guy said, well, if you got dogs, it's pretty much a slam dunk. That's just a bunch of bull <laughs> Excuse me. I mean, it's, a... and I think they get a lot of that from some of the videos, you know, they show, they just show guys turning dogs out of their truck on a big old fresh line track in the snow and they you know those dogs smoke it down you know and and uh, they catch a lion and I and I'm not saying anything against snow hunting because I know it can be very difficult too. believe me I I've looked like a fool in snow before but and my dogs have looked like fools in snow before but if you get the right track in the right conditions in snow, I mean, I, I think what makes it so much easier is you actually know. I mean, you see a big old round track, and, you know, you know it's a lion track, and uh, you know which direction they're going, and you know, and I'm sure those guys up north they get really good at aging tracks, so they know, and, 
they can smoke it down, you know, and usually most of the places they hunt like that, there's roads everywhere, so, you know, they can, they can intercept, you know, they can hit a crossroad or something and make up some time on those dogs. So, I mean, that's some of the things that make it easier, but this, this, this crap right here, I mean, this is tough. I mean, and, and you can talk to most anybody who dry ground lion hunts. It's, you know, we trail quite a bit, you know. I, if I'm hunting hard, you know, I can hit a lion track, you know, every third day or so. Now, catching is a different story. And uh, if you get on the right end of it and you're going the right direction and it's, you know, an overnight track or less, you know, or and he's made a kill or he's messing around in there, or, you know, if conditions are right, you can, you can catch him. You know, but it's not, it's dang sure not a slam dunk like that guy said. Anyway, I wanted to see how this, this new mic does. See if any way I could rig it up when I'm riding my mule and if the sound quality is good or, or what have you. I think I turned it on, I hope I turned it on. Yeah, I turned it on. Anyway, and I want to give a shout out to Seller. Appreciate your support and your kind comments. Uh, it, it, you know, I'm, I'm anybody who tries to create something, they really appreciate, you know, somebody making a, a, a good remark or a good comment on there saying they like your stuff, you know. I'm, I'm still an amateur at it. I'm learning. I think I'm getting better. My editing skills are better. My equipment still kind of sucks, but I'm getting better. I mean, I'm getting better equipment. I'm trying to figure out what makes better equipment. But anyway. I'm gonna get the drone out, fly the drone for a little while. And uh, so you guys can kind of see what kind of country we're going through right now. And, and heck, I might splice it in where you see the drone flying while I'm talking, I don't know. Probably better to watch that than watch me. Anyway, is that all I have to say? Nothing else, all right. Well. You know, thanks for the support. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, share, like, all those things they say in all those videos that you're supposed to do. And I'm gonna try, I'll, I'll try to, I'll try this year to post a video. If I get to hunt enough and, and, and things, you know, happen, I'll try to post a video every week of something. I've got enough of those Dale Lee tapes where I could post them for, well, I got a, I posted four, I think, and I've got 19 of them, so. I'll try to post one of those every week or something. If we're doing anything interesting or something, I'll post that. I, let's see how, how it goes. Anyway, sounds good. Thanks for watching.